What's going on, you guys? I'm playing tanks superiority. I don't know why I'm in the mood to. I just, I feel like driving tanks, you know, and I have to worry about some chopper shooting me in the freaking face. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, I don't know. One of the things I'm going to talk to you about today, go on a little rant about this topic, was how fast I ranked up. And, uh, I actually don't remember because at the time when I would actually play, is this tank not sprinting? Like, what the fudge? There we go. But anyway, when I started playing, I was not planning on being on the top of the leaderboards. I wasn't planning on none of that. You know, I, it's like, I, I just got real addicted to this game, you know. Started out, started playing it. Played it for like the week until Call of Duty came out. Played Call of Duty a couple days. Hated it. I was like, you know what? I'm going to come back. And that's basically it. I just got addicted to it, and I played it for years, practically. Just non-stop. No other game I cared about. Holy, why am I just driving into these people? But yeah, and it's just... I didn't plan on getting to the top of the leaderboard. I didn't even think I was, like, that good. I wasn't a competitive player at the time. I didn't know nothing. It was a newbie. I was just basically point horned it up, basically. And I was playing with one of my friends, and it was kind of like a competition, you know. It was between me and uh, Phoenix. A few, of, a few of other friends, I guess, too. But, I mean, mainly between me and him, I would play, like, every day. He'd get on, bang. We just would play a lot. And... It was kind of like that competition, you know, who could rank up first, you know, I wanted to be Colonel 100 first, I got to the Eagle first, you know, like, and that had to be within, like, a week, if that, you know, it was like, I played so much, and when I was ranking up, it's just like, I don't know, I just got addicted to it, you know, it was just a competition, wanted to keep ranking up, and I finally got to Colonel 100, or I got to, well, actually, let me start, go back a little bit, I got to the Colonel, I don't remember exactly, but it was in the 80s, and, uh, the thing disappeared, like the the rank thing. I don't know if you guys remember, but when the game first came out, once you got to a certain level, Colonel 80, it was in the mid 80s, I think. The eagle would disappear next to your name, and it would look like you have no rank, like you are a noob. And I got so much hate mail. I can't shoot straight, by the way. I got so much hate mail though when that happened because everyone thought I was a cheater. I was killing them so fast. You know, I knew all the spots. I was doing everything, and yet. They were thinking some no ranker who never played the game is whooping them. You know what I mean? And it's just. But I, I'd say I got Colonel 100. I don't even know. Maybe three weeks to a month. I'm not sure. I don't remember. I wasn't planning on you know doing it. You know, like I didn't wasn't keeping track. I didn't even. Yo, hello tank. I didn't even know I was uh, towards the top of the leaderboards. <clears throat> Literally, I started like getting mad and talking to them like, when are they gonna fix this? I called EA, EA a lot, trying to figure out why my rank isn't showing up. And come to find out, it was a problem a lot of people had. My battle log wasn't working. A lot of things weren't working. And I was just trying to figure out where I was on the leaderboard. There, there was a lot of cheaters on the leaderboard. So I, I think I was like, where was I? Like in the 300s or something. I was like, wow, that's not good. You know, I'm not, I don't consider that on the leaderboards. And all of a sudden, I got up one day and they had fixed everything. I mean, all the names were, like, all the cheaters were gone. I was like, what? I was so excited. I think I got to uh, top 12, I think. I'm not sure. Well, I couldn't. Oh, two guys on that tank. Yeah, but I think I was top 12 once they erased them. And literally from that moment on, I just started playing a lot more. Because I wanted to see how high I could go. And amazingly, I didn't play as much as other people. I'm going to throw that out there. I will talk about it. I will. Carlos Evil, and yeah, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to mention names, <laughs> yeah, but he just plays a lot, you know, and there's rumors he played, two people play on his account, I don't know, I, I'm i not saying he did, I'm not saying he didn't, I'm just saying he played a lot, whatever, whoever was on that account played a lot, and that's just, I was not going to try to match the time, I was just trying to see how high I could get, got to number three is where I stopped, and I, I wasn't planning on doing it. Like I said, I really wasn't. I just saw an opportunity, and I was like, wow. I knew I played the game a lot, but I didn't think it was to get to that high of a level. And to have that high of a score per minute, it, with the amount of time played, really, that helped a lot. You know, I wasn't camping, didn't, and I didn't always have a buttload of teammates following me around, repairing me, and doing that crap. Like, I've seen some of these other people going for the leaderboards. They literally have, like, a posse of noobs just chasing them. Reviving them, you know. I had people who would run around knifing with me, but that was about it. You know, I didn't have those people dedicated to, hey, you need to die to save my life. No, that that's stupid. You know, that I never liked that. That, that just got annoying fast. You know what I mean? But 
literally, like, this game is so fun. I just, there was a few problems I didn't like on it, you know, and uh, I'm not going to really get into it, like, the competitive side. I'm not going to talk about it. You all know, if you watch my videos, you know what I feel about that. But it's just a fun game. This game, to me, is the best of all time, at least for me, FPS-wise. It was just, it, I don't know. I don't know how to describe it. It was just such a good game. They did it so well. I love when they put vehicles in. Holy crap, I'm about to die. This is not good. And I jumped down the wrong side because, you know, I wasn't thinking. I haven't played this game a lot recently. <coughs> but it, this game, if if you haven't played this game and you just happen to be watching one of these videos, I doubt that's the case, but this game is fun. You should definitely get it. The, if you just... Battlefield 3 is, to me, is a game you can get on and you can have fun, period. You know, yeah, there's things that will annoy people you know suppression but that's for the people who really play this game you know if you just are gonna get on and have fun this game is, is the game to do it you know if you want to do it on the FPS version I mean you can run around try hard you could run around with a tank you can be why did I jump out of the tank oops oopsie but you, you can be in a jet you can be in AC-130 you can be in a helicopter you could be in a boat I mean you can do everything you know and it's just that's Call of Duty doesn't have that and most likely never will you know what I mean? I mean, this, you could C4, throw C4 on a Jeep, freaking dirt bike, a jet, I mean, you could throw it on whatever. And that is just what makes this game so fun and why it did so good, you know, marketing-wise. You know, a lot of people bought it, a lot of people left Call of Duty 2 here simply for the fact it's so fun. You know what I mean? I mean, it totally beats Call of Duty hands down when it comes to that. You know, just this game is, to me, it's my favorite game. I'll come back and play this years down the road I will still be playing this game just come back play good times I have a lot of good memories on here you know I play with friends who have passed away since then you know it's just it brings back good memories when I before I even knew what competitive gaming was I mean wow I'm stuck but th this game it just it has so many good memories for me that's one reason I'll never leave it you know I had the most fun I've ever had gaming was on this game I mean it is that good and holy crap I need to get out of here getting double teamed I, I thought I had bad aim yeah, but I mean, this game, and a lot of people think I don't like it. I don't know why you guys say that. I, I don't like that it doesn't have competitive. But that's the only reason. I mean, you just want a fun game to play. This is it. Forget Call of Duty. This is the game to get. I mean, Call of Duty, I can't even play it unless I have a team now. I mean, this game, I'm on by myself, you know. This is just come back to play. You can have fun. You know, I do wish people communicated more, you know, when you go to team chat. I don't hear a lot of that. From the start of that game, I did not hear a lot of people who had mics. Don't know why. You know, Call of Duty, everybody freaking has a mic. All those little freaking rat kids and stuff like that have mics. But I just, on this game, I I never really seen, like, a whole lobby that has mics. And even when they say, oh, you got to have a mic or I'll kick you, I, I still don't see people with mics. You know, and it's just this game that I, I would always be in a party, you know. I just, I didn't see the point to go to team chat because no one's ever talking. I don't know why, but... I don't know what it is. I mean, I think some people didn't understand how to switch to team where you can hear everybody, you know, all that sort of stuff. I think that's one of the things that people didn't like. And holy crap, I'm literally getting raped by a tank. I am literally getting raped. <laughs> yeah, but that's just the way I felt about it. And hopefully Battlefield 4 will be that way. And it looks like it will, because in a lot of ways it looks like Battlefield 3, and but that they fix stuff, you know. So that that's big, you know. I... I only pre-ordered two games, and that's probably the only games I'm going to get when it comes out, because that is going to be a lot of money. <coughs> Excuse me, when you think of it, to get a new Xbox, and since the mic doesn't come with it, I might, I'll might i have to get a mic. And I don't think I'm going to get the little cheap Xbox mic that comes with it. I'm going to try to get Astros, and I don't know when that's going to come out. Like, It's probably not going to be on release of the new Xbox. But I'm going to be getting those. i got to get new Xbox. i got to get new headset, preferably Astros. And then I gotta get a new recording device because I know the P uh, PVR one I have will not work. It it doesn't even record on a monitor. I still record off component cables, and that's why I'm playing this on the TV because my monitor doesn't have it. And I am just too cheap to get an Elgato right now because it's not gonna work. From what I saw, they don't even the people at Elgato don't know if it will work on the new consoles, Xbox One or PS4. They said they don't know, and uh, for some reason they haven't like given the specs or whatever you want to call it to the recording people to let them know that hey you know because a lot of people make videos I mean not the only one and it's if there's no recording device in the beginning you know that's just stupid you know what I mean and it's like I don't know what I'm gonna get I don't know when the recording device will be out 
either, like, when they're actually gonna come out with it. Oh, I can't think and try to not get ran over. You can have that tank, buddy. But it's just... Oh, he jumped out. Oh, I still got him. <laughs> but that, that's what I'm hoping. I hope there's some good recording device. Like, if the Elgato would work, the ones that are out now, if it would work on the new Xbox, i go buy one right now. I could do so much more if I went and got that. Could live stream, could record on a monitor, could... Oh my gosh, you could do so much stuff. I mean, but... So if you guys here, if you can record on the... the Gato, whatever you freaking call it. If you can record on that, on the new Xbox, because that's what I'm getting. Let me know, please. So tell me on Twitter, tell me wherever, because... If I could, I would go buy one right now. Because I miss out on so much. Like, even when I'm playing Call of Duty, I don't... I know you guys don't like Call of Duty, but... I was playing a team and they were raging so hard. And the thing is, the only way I can record on that game is to go back to theater mode then record there and you don't get to hear the the voices and that just absolutely sucks because it, it was the most raging I've heard on a game that's how bad he was raging and I could not record it I mean that oh my gosh that was so annoying they were cussing they were doing everything they hated my guts I don't know why probably because I killed them a lot I think I thought someone was on this morning yeah but just let me know and then I gotta get as well on top of all that the, uh, Call of Duty Ghost and Battlefield 4 and there's a lot of other games that are coming out too I mean like and at the moment I don't have a job so it, I gotta get a job soon looking around not finding any at the moment kinda hard over here but there's a lot of bad guys you know I'm just you know running around being bored but you know it's just and I know there was something else I want a new scuff because I highly doubt they're gonna make adapters for the scuff so it's gonna be pretty hectic and I don't really know how I'm gonna record the first days of the new Xbox if unless there's a recording device that comes out because one I don't know is I'm pre-ordering it at Best Buy and I don't know if Best Buy will have a um, recording device there that will work at least on the launch date you know and that's what's I don't know what I'm gonna do I'll figure something out though so don't worry I mean if I have to I'll put a camera in front of the freaking TV but I don't like quality but hey you know gotta do what you gotta do holy crap I really need to get a new headset to record on because this freaking one is so delayed. Like I die then hear the shooting. Why am I not taking that tank? I'm I'm just not thinking. You know, I'm too into this conversation with you guys. But yeah, and that's that's basically gonna do it. And keep giving me topics. I know this gameplay was kind of boring. But I just felt like playing some. What the heck? Why did he jump out the tank? I just felt like playing some tank superiority though. And yes, I just stole this guy's tank. And I'm gonna go die since I'm gonna end the game. I'm gonna just run up in his face and try to die, you know? Oh, the green guy jumped out. Son of a biscuit. Anyway, just keep giving me topics. What do you want me to? What, what do you want me to talk about? You know, I talked about the knife, talked about the 416, autos, guns. Just keep giving me topics. If you're new to the videos, go ahead and subscribe. If you don't know, and one of you just asked, why do I put like a day, yada yada yada, like 96 or whatever in the description? Is because I'm trying to do a video day for a year, and I'm numbering it so I can go back and. You know, in the future, look, it just, it makes it simpler. You know, and for the people who are wondering. So I'm coming up on day 100. Anyway, that's going to do it. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed, and have a nice day.